one's going to sit there and, and uh, do a, uh, a solder joint that's very, very difficult. It's aluminum to copper. And what we are using is a Turbo Torch product. It's called the Viper uh, Flux Paste, and it's, an, it's a soft solder process, but very effective. And we're going to use just a regular SX solder to, to join this together. And if you want to show it and demonstrate it and how we're going to do this, you're going to heat up the copper, come down onto the aluminum, heat it for just a second. When you see the fluxes start to, to bubble, you know that the temperature is just about there. As soon as the solder, or get ready to go, and as soon as you see that and it's bubbling and it touch the solder to it, remove the flame, and you should be able to complete the, the joint. Okay. We'll find out. First time I've ever done this. Isn't that nice? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not me. <laughs> it's the tech. It's all about the technique and having the right equipment to take on to the job. Plain and simple. My name is Stefan. I'm with Ah Cool AC and Refrigeration in South Florida, and I just soldered copper to aluminum for the first time. <laughs> this is cool. I've never done it before. Everything's coming out now. Aluminum's coming out in everything now. And if you don't know how to solder aluminum, you're gonna be you're not gonna make any money. And that's one of the reasons I'm at the shop. That was you know that was so much easier than I thought. Yeah, it is. Can I use the same stuff and do top to top? No, I wouldn't. Okay. I wouldn't suggest it. Because you, what you'd want to do is just go rather the regular pace flux. Because for two reasons. The flux is going to be a higher temperature mm -hmm. and it and it protects a little bit longer. This okay. is fast. This is you saw how fast it yeah, no, it's going to go. It, it, it goes from being workable to difficult real quickly. And so you have to be ready to go and do the job and get out of it. This is mine. I, I'm, I'm repossessing this from you. That's yours. This is cool. I'm amazed. I really am. I mean, I always still tape them, but it doesn't... I'm not doing this for the camera. I really am amazed. I mean... I thought... 30, 40 years ago, I had to weld aluminum with a torch. And I probably did it about 50 times, you know, melted it 50 times, until I got about this much of it done and I passed that course. So I never touched aluminum since because of that experience. And that's why I was scared to do aluminum now, you know. For the same reason. Yeah, because I figured if I screw up somebody's coil, that's an expensive mistake. Yeah, you know, I'm not rich like you. I can't just afford to replace <laughs> yeah. the guy's coil. Uh -huh. So, you know, I didn't... So I figured, okay, it's cheap enough to come to the show, to fly up here and whatever. Good. Uh, it's cool. That's good stuff. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. You betcha.